So hi everybody and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to go ahead and get the Cody 21 re-release called Night Lice. So stay tuned. I'll show you how to get it step by step. It's time for streaming. So hi everybody and welcome to my channel. Thanks for tuning in. Today I'm on the Fire Stick 4K Max second generation. If you're looking for a new Fire Stick, check out my descriptions down below. Got a couple of links. You click on it. No extra cost to you. Small commission to me, and it goes to help out the channel to bring you more good videos. Okay, so let's go ahead now and get the Cody 21 Night Lies. And this is what you need to get it. So on the home screen, let's go over to the magnifying glass and down to search. Click on search, go over to the letter D, click on D, and then down to downloader. Underneath apps and games, you'll see where it says downloader. Go ahead and click on that enter button on your remote. Here it says download, you own it. Go ahead and download it. Let's wait for it to install and then open up. If you like what you see, please click on that like and subscribe button and ring that bell. That way you know when I do put up more videos. Now here it is where it says open. Let's go ahead, click on open. Click on allow and then say okay. So right where it says enter a URL, go up, click on that enter button, type in Cody. TV. And click on go. You're going to be redirected to the Cody homepage. Right across from Cody is three lines or the hamburger menu, some people call it. Go ahead and give it a click. Go over to the left. Let's go back down to where it says download. Go ahead and click on download. Now what you want to do is find the platform that you're using. Right now, a lot of people are using Android, so let's go ahead and click on Android. Now, normally you would go ahead and go down to where it says Cody version 20.2. And you would click on one of the ones here, either a 64 bit or you will click on the 32 bit. All depends on which device you're using and what it has. A lot of NVIDIA shields are running on 64 bit. So you would go ahead and you would download the 64 bit version. We're on the fire stick and it runs 32. So we'll just go ahead. Now let's go back up a little bit. And right here where it says pre release, go ahead and click on it. Here it shows you Cody version 21 Omega pre-release builds. So let's go ahead and click on the 32 bit. Give it a few seconds for us to be redirected. It's going to go ahead and start to download. So after you download a downloader, we have to go into settings and allow the permissions. Install unknown apps. Go down, go ahead and turn it on. Go back, click the back button again, click it again. Click on open. So here it's asking me if I want to go ahead and install the Cody. Go over to the left and click on install. Sometimes when you have to go into settings and you click on OK to allow install for unknown apps, you click that back button too many times, it's going to bring you right back to that downloader page and you're going to have to go ahead and type in all the information again. But it goes pretty fast. App installed, let's go ahead now and click on the back button on your remote. Click on delete, click on delete again. Just only delete the file out of the downloader folder. This way it doesn't take room up on your Fire Stick. Go ahead, click that home button on your remote. Go over to the right to where the three squares and a plus sign is. Let's go down and find Cody. Go over to the right, here it is, highlight it. On your remote, there's a lines, three lines button. Go ahead and click on it. Say move to front. Click that home button. You want to make sure that it's there. Go over to the right again. Highlight Cody. Go ahead and click on it. And click it one more time. Here you get a message that says allow Cody to record audio. While using the app, go ahead and click on it. Allow Cody to access photos and media on your device. Yes, because what it is, remember, Cody is a media player, and that's what we're using it for. Go ahead, click on Allow. 
So here it is. It's running the first time. Give it a few seconds to boot up. There it is. Now you could go ahead and use your Kodi for anything that you have on your Fire Stick. TV shows, your music, you can put your music on here, music videos, some TV, some radio, games, add ons, any type of add ons that you have. You could go ahead and add it into your Kodi. Like I have right here, it's an official app by Amazon called Forsome Horror. You can add that into your Kodi media player. And then you can watch it right through Kodi. Back over to the left, you could go ahead and put pictures on here, some more videos. You got your favorites and then the weather. I hope you find this video very helpful and entertainment. Leave your comments down below. Remember, Kodi is a media player. Use it as for what you want. And remember, day or night, it's time for streaming.